Hello and welcome to the show. I am here today on GTA 5, having just robbed a bank with a uh, kind of an escape plan. My my plan is we are going to get to the airport. Oh, that's not the way we go. Uh, that is a very important part of the plan, in fact. We must run the wrong way, look at the wall for a split second, and then run the correct way. Very important bank robbing tips. Okay, you've got, you've got to do that. It's sort of superstition. I'm going to go with that. Uh, we are going to be, uh, yeah, try to get away, get to the airport, uh, steal a plane, and take off. That is the, oh, bugger, they're here already. Helicopter, run away from that. Fortunately, I've got a getaway car uh, position. We've got in the wrong side because my character is a moron, but never mind. We are in and we are away. I'm not quite sure. Uh, are they going to... Yeah, okay, so we've got some... Ah, there's a policeman over this side as well. Uh-oh. We've got to get to the airport. But that is not going to be an easy feat because we've already got uh, cars after us. There are guards at the airport. And I've got to try and get a plane and take off. Now, I do have the Vaca, which is a lovely, fast supercar. However, kind of distinctive. So trying to sneak my way into an airport... Uh, is going to be difficult. Admittedly, it is also quite difficult for people giving chase a uh, all-black vacuum. Well, it has got bright orange wheels. I love my vacuum. It's a fantastic car. But uh, trying to keep track of this in, in the night time might be on the tad difficult side. There was a heli- I don't know where the helicopter's gone. This is one of the uh, the tougher parts is I can, I can lose the helicopter under here. We can do some clever maneuvering. Uh, around the uh, tunnel places and we can lose the helicopter but is at what point do I abandon the vacuum? I really want to get nice and far away before we uh, abandon this because it is surprisingly easy in the you know 30 seconds that I'm busy swapping cars for people to notice what I've stolen so we are gonna go try and get nice and far away this is probably not such a clever place to go uh, if we abandon it here this looks pretty sound, really. Oh, no, it's not sound. Saw the helicopter. <laughs> okay, it's, 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 hard for, um, it's hard for them to see me, but equally it's hard for me to see them when it is the dead of night. Well, that was an idea. The helicopter is still on us. So that's going to be a bugger to lose. I definitely saw a Stanier over that way. I'm hoping... Oh, there's a Stanier directly behind us. That, yeah, that's what I was saying. It's actually, you know, a little bit tougher uh, than you might think, even with the huge, huge performance of this car to shake people that are giving chase and that are relatively well organised uh, who are giving chase. We've got to use alleyways to our advantage. We've got to use as much undercover terrain as we can to cause issues with that helicopter. He's doing a really bloody good job of uh, following the car. Oh, I think that might be helicopter down. <laughs> <laughs> that makes my life a lot easier. The helicopter got a little bit too brave, clipped a building, and is out. Vacca is also very noisy. Oh, crap. That is not a fun a fun thing to see. That's really unfortunate for me. Turn around a corner and there'll be a stanny air. Oh, they've dented up my Vacca. Ooh, although we are going to abandon it anyway. So, I mean, that's, uh, <laughs> that's a minor inconvenience. Uh, no, I can't go down that way because that's a dead end. Using my amazing knowledge of the GTA 5 map. To, well, it's not really a dead end. It does loop back out again, but they can block me in with a little bit more ease than I would like. We need to get a few corners away. So we're going to try and do lots of quick changes of direction, get a few corners away so that we get to a stage where they don't know what way I've gone. And then we might be able to abandon the car. Ooh, plan. So with the helicopter down, and it looks like the standing airs are a little bit too far away now. Just the, the burst of speed and the weaving in and out of the... Uh, kind of building area. My plan is we're going to head for the hills. Not really where I intended on going whatsoever, but if we head towards the hills, we can hide our car in a garage somewhere. Now that gives me the advantage in that uh, we can keep the car a little bit better off the road. So if we, oh, this is perfect. Okay, if we park that in there, bail, a very quick check around. Da, 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 da. Nothing to see here. Everything is normal. Steal an a strope, a nice normal car. We will also go and change our star. I can't do it while I'm in a car. That is unfortunate. Did not realise that. Uh, we're going to have to have another plan here. Okay, we're going to find the next garage, pull in. Because oh, I cannot be I cannot be driving around in this. It is a little bit too obvious a retire. Uh, no, I do not want to be doing that game. Thank you. That would be a really unfortunate way to die. 
Okay, car over here. We're going to jump the wall and climb around back quickly. No, we're not going to jump the wall because there is nothing there. We're going to take a very, very quick crouch down behind here. Da, 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 da. Uh, that might be another helicopter, right? One of the surviving players may have gone and grabbed a helicopter. That would make sense, really. It's a clever enough plan. Okay, we have put the gun away, you tit. That will be a big old giveaway. Right, we are incognito mode now. And we've got to find a way into the airport. Uh, people were telling me that you can get the window fixed uh, if you unarm and stick your finger out the window. It will wind it down in such a way uh, where... Oh, I can't because it's on the wrong side of the bloody car. That's not good. Right, we may have to swap out the astrope. I am hoping that in a searching situation that they won't take a second look at that. It's a big hope, mind. Ah, right, I see the helicopter. Now, the, uh, the tense, the tense part begins. There are going to be cars searching, scouring the city. They roughly know where I got away. I don't think they saw me go as far as the hills, though. That is good news. Because if they'd seen me get to the hills and then, uh, you know, if I'd just about shaken them getting to the hills, if they knew the rough area where I was, that makes it really tough. That makes it really tough because they can just swarm that area and then every little thing is a giveaway. So the fact that the helicopter wasn't searching at the hills does give me some hope. There is one. That was one of them. That car was heavily beaten up. That's not going to be an AI Stania. Oh, okay, they, they are kind of in the area. That's a little bit scarier than I would like. That was the helicopter as well. I didn't quite see where it went. Now, if they find the Vacker, we might be in luck because if they can find if they find the vacca they might still think i'm in that area and all rush to that side of the map I and mean, that's like a fairly good sort of clue fairly good giveaway that that might be me over there so if they can find that car that works in my favor perhaps i shouldn't have hidden it so well i was kind of working on the on the principle that uh you know hiding my car would be good if they were close behind me but if they're further behind me hiding it isn't such a good plan. Like either way, can or can't. I don't know what he's doing. So we're gonna just sneak past. That was definitely a green light. Oh, I think I'm fortunate that there were no players around. No, that's the sort of thing that's going to give me away. If there had been, you know, a Stania around watching, they would have seen that. They would have gone to investigate and probably found out that it was me. Unless I'm really, really good at acting. There is another Stania. I've got to follow it because I'm in this lane and I can't go and suddenly change direction. Uh, that's not fun. I've got to stay over here as well, because if I do a sudden lane change, it's going to look really, really suspicious. Thankfully, we are in the green. Oh, I'm not liking this. This is terrifying. This is really, really scary. I don't even know if that's a smooth... Like, you've got to really think about every little movement you are doing, because the AI will do uh, certain stuff. Now, there is a trick... That's not going to work. Uh, <laughs> there is a trick to having the brake lights come on, and I'm not sure there. If we can kind of hold it like that. This is such an awkward angle to hold it. I'm only doing it because I know there were cars around. And the issue with doing this is now I can't really look about very well. That's really... I've got to hold the handbrake, hold the throttle slightly, and hold the brake slightly. That's going to really hurt. I can't do this at many of the at many of the junctions. But I do also fear if I go to pull away, I'm just going to do a giant burnout. Which is, again, another particularly... Um, obvious <laughs> obvious side where i am a little bit less on the break now another thing that i have to think about is how are we going to get into the airport from what i know of the area they have got uh, a couple of guard oh, we have a little bit of issue getting away they've got a guard on each of the main gates there are three gates into the airport and that is a very low flying helicopter if we talk quietly maybe it won't notice me and it hasn't noticed me that's good there are going to be a guards on each of the main gates there are also going to be a couple of guards i think circulating the runways i don't really know where they're going to be though so we have the conundrum of do i i mean i could just jump my way into the airport but it's kind of a big giveaway i could try and just drive my way into the airport take out a guard drive through the gate and get in risky but it could work if i can you know find a sneaky place to uh, to get to get a guard away from now we could try go over the fence if we steal a van or a truck we can leap over the fence not the easiest 
but it could work. I also had a minor heart attack because I thought I saw a helicopter shadow. Yeah, not the easiest to, to make work, but if it does, it means I get more options in terms of ways in. Okay, and I'm just, I'm just giving a check. I saw black cars and started getting worried. I kind of want to go scout out the area, but of course, the more time I spend in close proximity, the higher the possibility of someone seeing me. Uh, hmm. That was a plane or helicopter shadow? Not sure. It's oh, come, come on camera. It's really difficult. I want to look around. I really want to look around everywhere. But then if I'm not looking forward, I can miss the green light, and that can be the thing that gives me away. Just all of these little things that we've got to worry about. Where are the cars? I don't have a particularly fast car at the moment either. That is the uh, the bad news. That was a little bit close fugitive. I don't know what on earth you're doing there. <laughs> Bloody AI. Sometimes they are real morons. Yeah, I don't have a great car. If we come to a getaway situation, I do not have any performance advantage. The Astrope is not a bad car. I mean, we saw in the budget car challenge, in fact, the Astrope was pretty, pretty solid. It did a lot better than a lot of cars. And a lot better than I expected, in all honesty. However, it's certainly, it's certainly not VACA performance. Uh, and neither is... Uh, it's probably still about level with the Stanier. Now, I could try and swap cars. I could try and go for the Corvette. Well, the Corvette's trying to go visit the grass. I'm not quite sure what's going on there. Um, yeah, I could try swap cars. I'm not going to do it here because I'm next to the police station. But if you go for a supercar, that's sort of a vehicle that people are more likely to check. And a Strope? Is anyone going to take a second look at this car? Probably not. So we have got that going for us. There was some shouting behind me, but I don't quite know why. Uh, there is a, a police stand or a chaser standing here that's just done a U-turn and taken out the lights. Oh no! Okay, we're just going to go when these guys go. Okay, we want to head in this direction because that standing here did a U-turn. So <laughs> we're going to go over here. Really annoy the 9F. The helicopter is hovering over that part of the map at this moment in time. Oh, this is really scary. This is really bloody tense. I think this is more tense than Survive the Hunt. I have an objective. I know exactly where I want to be going, but I've got to pick a good route. I've got to pick a good route to get there, otherwise I'm going to be in a lot of bother. Oh, where can we go? Uh, we could... Do we try? It's very risky. We could try going around the outside of the airport by, like, jet ski or boat somewhere and we can we can't climb in though that's the issue the fence is so high around the that was a very sharp break i'm glad no one was around the fence is too high to really climb over and going that way by jet ski is or, or any any form of vessel is quite noticeable because the ai aren't out on boats and that is kind of not want to go if there's a, if there's a car circulating the area that notices that is it going to be a big giveaway and i'm not going to be able to get anywhere near close enough in time maybe we head do we head towards the motorway i can hear a helicopter as well that's not fun we could head towards the motorway and maybe try and steal a car maybe try and steal a truck on the motorway Oh, that is a very low-flying helicopter that is around behind me. Now, I don't know if they've spotted that I am acting suspicious or whether they are just following this area. So we will wait and see. There's a freaked out a sea at the moment. I can't really go anywhere. There is now a police car behind me as well that is... I don't know if they're just suspicious at this moment in time or they're waiting for more people. Now, if I bolt, of course, they're going to know exactly where I am. If I don't bolt, they, there's a chance they're going to try and get out of their vehicles and shoot me. But if they get out of the vehicles and shoot me, then they are going to... There's a, there's a sort of a chance for me to try and find a way to get away in all of this. Uh, so now we are very boxed in with the uh, cars. All right, we've got to go. We've got to go. <laughs> there, is, uh, there is no second choice about this one. We have got to uh, get moving. Bugger. I think it was my turning, actually, that gave me away. I think I was... Um, a little too janky on the turning that the helicopter spotted, which is a little bit unfortunate for me. We just got to do what we can. Ah, apparently we have got a little bit more performance than the uh, Strope. 
I would have lost the helicopter in all of that manoeuvre, which is good news. I did talk about potentially going on the motorway, so that's what we're going to, where we're going to head now. Uh, actually, we're not going to head down the motorway. I'm just going to kind of try... Uh, helicopter's back again. We can't shake the helicopter down this part of the map. We could... I did actually have a thought, but uh, it's not going to work now. We could go down the sewer... Not the sewer tunnels, like the construction tunnels. We could head down there. The helicopter can't follow us. Can I outrun the Stanier down there, though, would be the bigger question. Eh, it's possible. My plan here is we're going to jump back down. I'm trying to confuse the helicopter. I can worry about the car on its own. The car is less of a threat than the helicopter. Uh, we've got to kind of loop around undercover as and where we can. Uh, this is strobe is good. I'm liking it. It's a solid, solid car. Um, their plan to try and sort of block me in worked very, very well in terms of... They didn't kind of rush anything. They tried to get numbers there to help out. The AI freaking out was what really helped me in all of that. The uh, the AI getting a little bit confused kind of helped me. Oh, that's not helpful, though. That's a big spin. Okay, you're going to push me this way? Fine, I'll go this way. Uh, we need to lose that helicopter, and I don't have car performance on this one. This is where you kind of wish I had gone for a 9F. <sighs> Just trying to be sneaky. It was just me trying to be on the sneaky side of things. We're really using all the alleyways that I know around here to as, as much effect as possible. Now, I could try and find... Oh, I nearly lost the back end. Had to have a huge correction on the steering. Ah, is that orange car? Ah, my orange car might be a chaser as well. We did say that if they completely wreck their Staniers, they can get in another civilian car. So that orange vehicle could be one, or it could just be a freaked out AI in an orange car. That either is possible. The cars are having trouble keeping up. This Astrope is a bloody good car. Gotta give it credit. Where credit is due, the Astrope is uh, quite uh, quite impressive performance. A helicopter, though. <laughs> a helicopter is proving a real ass to shake. Uh, we've kind of circled around, which is not a good idea. We ended up going back on ourselves, which makes the chasing cars have an easier time following me. Really, the player-controlled helicopters do a damn sight better job of following than the uh, AI-controlled ones that I go up against in versus the army. <sighs> There's a standing air too close. I had a plan for a maneuver. We go in here, do a U-turn, shoot back out the other way. That confuses helicopters. Standing air is way, way too close, though. Standing air has done a good job in, in keeping up with me. There's an alleyway somewhere around here that we can dart down, but it is uh, not close enough at the moment. We could go in the storm drain. Storm drain's good. But, are there tunnels? There are tunnels out of it. If I knew my way around it better, I could do a cunning plan. But uh, I don't. And one of the real important things at this stage in a chase, I cannot make a mistake. If I crash my car, I am done for. So I've got to, I've got to push. I've got to push really hard, but not make a mistake. <laughs> as they just took out the orange vehicle. That gives me a chance here. That gives me a momentary respite if they're a little bit further back that I might be able to use to good effect. Yeah, because they're sort of out of the line of sight, which means if I can keep... The frame rate is having a poo at the moment, but if I can keep out of line of sight, we will be doing well. Just thought I heard a helicopter. I think the helicopter might have lost me. No, it hasn't. You see, it's right back there again. Problem is, with me trying to circle around this area, I can't lose the helicopter easily. There is just no way of doing it quickly. We need to get away from the cars... And then I need to use an undercover area. I've got a plan. That's not going to work, though, is it? That's too... Ah, I had a great idea. However, it's probably not going to work. I'm hoping now the helicopter's going to go... Ah, the Stanier came around the corner and saw me. Bugger. I had a great plan there. We might have shaken the helicopter, but the bloody Stanier was just at the right point to see where I went. Damn. Yeah, we, we, we would have lost the helicopter in that, but the Stanier saw exactly where I was heading. That's the tunnel I was talking about that could work if we get desperate. Okay, jump back in here again. I'm going under these cover areas. That Stanier is just, just keeping up. If we had that little bit more performance, if we had that little bit more speed in our car, we could do this. Not with ease. Unfortunately, we have only got one car giving chase. Now, that helps me out a huge amount in all of this. With just one car giving chase, it makes it a little bit more likely for me to be able to find a way to shake it, have him make a mistake somewhere. Uh, we're going to dive into the train yard, but this is trouble. 
I have lost cars in here before, people in here before, but it is asking for a lot of trouble because you can get boxed in, you can get caught out in an area that uh, there is sort of no way, uh, no, no escape out of. And of course, they are around this area. They have seen where I've gone. Unlike with the Vaca, where I had that lot more time to work with, they have seen that I'm about, I'm about uh, here. Where are they? Do they know which side I'm going to pop out of? Doesn't look like it. So I'm really concentrating hard here. Oh, that might have worked. Okay, we've got to ditch this car. The strope is uh, burnt as anything. We will need something new. Oh, we will need something new pretty fast. Oh no, don't tell me. Okay, so there's been a little bit of disconnection problem. I'm hoping that people are now going to get rejoined. Sadly, that is the way GTA 5 goes sometimes. Thank you, person. Random, random person. Yeah, don't you bloody go start doing that. We've got to abandon. We've got to abandon our car. And get something quick. This is going to do. Uh, oh, no, 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 no. We don't need police. We do not need police. That is not good news. That is not good news. That is not good news. Lester, Lester, come help. Come help. Bad things are going on right now. Uh, come on, come on. Uh, no, don't set bounty. Remove wanted okay, level. My I'll oh. take care of the LSPD. Leave it to me. Thank you, Lester. You are a lifesaver. Right. Well, I mean, we have kind of ended up-ish where I want to be. I mean, we are still a fair way away from the airport, but we have lost our pursuers. In spectacular fashion, we have lost our pursuers, but it worked, and that is the critical, critical bit. Okay, I think my heart rate can normalise now. Oh, that window is so bloody off. Wait, hold on. If we... Oh, I've gone, again, I've gone in the wrong side of the car <laughs> to do this. In my panic to get a new vehicle, we have gone in the wrong side of the car. We're going to just have to take it easy and hope that they don't notice that. Again, that could have been what gave it away, to be honest. If they saw from, from afar, they saw that. Maybe. But I can't actually do anything about it. Now I'm in the car and I don't want to risk trying to swap... Trying to mess around, really, with the car is, is trouble. Uh, there's all sorts of shenanigans going on behind us. I don't know if these traffic lights... Okay, they aren't broken, so we are good to go now and head over, I think, this way. I don't really know this part of the map very well. This is like the part of the map that I tend, tend not to visit too often. So... I think there's a way to loop around and come back down towards the airport out here. Maybe. Hmm. There's definitely a couple of Staniers that I think have been changed uh, in places. What on earth are you doing, you moron? Uh, <laughs> bloody people. I could go and steal that car because I just saw them get out of it, so we know it's going to be unlocked. However, I think I'd rather be chased in the blister than be chased in the FQ2 because I don't think that's ever going to be quick enough to, uh, to get away. Right, I think one of these roads takes us to the airport. I don't know which way to go here. Uh, the van is really not keen on waiting for the red light. Oh, I guess, well, he wants to turn left, and which you can do. I want to turn right, but he's just gone around me to turn left. I mean, <laughs> that is one way to do things. What is he, uh, or did he or she? I can't quite tell. I think it's a she. I think they want to turn left as well, but they're also not too keen on going, then less keen on going around me. Hmm. What do we do? What do we do here? People who know the map are going to be shouting at me to go in a direction. I think I want to go that way. Possibly. Let's go and head there. See what we can do. Head around. If we stick to this outside, I think I know where we're going to end up. And I'm okay with that, because we're going to end up on the big bridge that goes across. Oh, are we not far enough along? Either way, I think we are heading... Come on, Regina, you're worse than me for setting off. Either way, I think we are heading where we want to be going... Uh, ah, is that the... Oh, God. I know we're getting close to the Spaghetti Junction part, but I don't know it from this angle, so we're going to head down there. In fact, this has worked out relatively nicely. Having lost my pursuers in the kind of train yard has, has really helped us out in terms of this 
of this chase. Have we got... Okay, I think we've got people back connected again, so it's just a momentary... Uh, a momentary crash. Xbox servers have been really unfriendly tonight, uh, so apologise for that one. It's just something that can happen. Do I go for... I think a truck is too obvious. A truck is going to be too closely checked going near the airport, so we're going to stick with a ballista. What we're going to do... We're going to do a reconnaissance lap. Oh, that window might be a giveaway, though. I want to do a reconnaissance lap just to see if I could see where the guards are, but that does mean getting a new car, because I think if there are guards around the place, they're going to spot us. That's not a very good traffic light system going on there. Either way, we're through safely. Glad no one was watching. Yeah, we'll go for a reconnaissance first, because I think... I, mean, I don't necessarily even want to be having a car getting into the airport. What I can do is take out a guard, walk in and sneak around the back. I think... Oh, piss. We can't actually... not supposed to... Uh, we are supposed to. We can turn that way. I thought there was a solid kind of like central reservation bit. There isn't. So we are good going across there. I've done an awful job of navigating that part. We're here. Uh, where? No, we don't even want to be... Oh, crap. I'm looking at the wrong green light and then he went. That would be a player fugitive looking at the smashed up car. Which has driven straight past me. Oh, where do we go? I mean, they're scouring the city. Now, they don't really know where I am. In all the confusion there, they have no clue where I've gone, which works out for me. But equally, I'm now in a little bit of struggle because I can't remember my way around this part of the map. I can't remember my way around this part well enough. I think we've got to get across, because this is where... We're heading towards the Simeon Dock at the moment. That's not the one that we want. We want the other side, really, of this waterfront area. So if we head... Oh, that's a parked car. We, oh, we're going to get hitched at the right time as well to uh, make the lights. We're going to head over this way. We kind of want to head towards the stadium. Head towards the stadium, which is somewhere in that direction, and we will be good. There's a lot of trucks that are tempting me. Uh, we kind of want to go over to this lane. Oh, that's a really shonky lane change. <laughs> Everything that can give me away now, I am monitoring. Oh, that Stratton would be tempting. But getting out, getting out of my car is super risky because it might look clear to me, but there could just be someone just driving around the corner that will notice. It's so, so dangerous. I mean, it's so important, swapping cars. You know, there's no doubt about that. But there are huge risks involved. Oh, that Stratum is really tempting, but I'm not going to go for it. Oh... It's, it's getting really nerve-wracking now. <laughs> we have, we've done okay in terms of avoiding the Staniers and Fugitives and so on. Well, I mean, that was uh, not at all the curse of the commentator. I kind of don't want to breathe, don't want to do anything. Just don't, don't give away my position when we are this close. I mean, we've still got so much to do, even if we get in too the airport, or even if we get to the airport even, we've got so much work to do. Where are you going? Bloody moron. There's another Stanny air behind me. I'm not taking my chances there. We're going down here. I'm hoping he wasn't looking because that was a janky corner because I got scared. Yeah, let's hope he wasn't looking. Uh, he's not directly behind me, so we can go and make this turn and it will still look natural. Oh, maybe not because he got really close to hitting me. Don't let there be anyone following me right now. Because we are really closing in on our destination. And to be fair, if things do start going sideways, I could just dive into the uh, subway tunnel right here. There is that. <laughs> there is always that option. I'm trying to think what my best way around to the airport is. I'm not actually sure at this from this point. Because I found myself in a really weird part of the map that I don't know. I think if we go straight on... Ooh, there is an idea here. That was a surprisingly wheel-spinny start from the Fugitive. Eh, I don't know. I do have an idea, but I'm not quite sure how to execute it. Because there is a... There is a I say there's a back way... Ah, no, I do know how to execute it. There is a back way in to the, uh, to the airport that I might now be able to use if we head... God, how do we get to it? Like around by the stadium, we can kind of... It's not sneak underneath. We can sneak underneath the motorway, basically, is what I'm going for here. And that is a really good point to be approaching from, I think. We'll see. 
We'll see. We'll take a left here. Have a quick glance around, and then a look, look at that. Oh, bloody hell, I wasn't even looking, and the stanny has gone whizzing up that way. Right, so if we head over in this direct... Oh, that was a terrible corner. Oh, thank God, that stanny air buggered off. That was I didn't know where the lines were going for my lane. So if we head to the left here... Yes, this is looking promising. This is looking promising indeed. For at least getting me to the airport. Deep breaths. Deep breaths. We are calm. We are relaxed. We might need a sniper rifle at some point. So don't get the heart rate too high. Probably going to need a sniper rifle just for scoping out the place. <sighs> okay, let's just have a look around. No sign of a helicopter. <laughs> Problem is trying to look around from all angles and keep an eye on the uh, bloody uh, traffic lights is quite difficult. Come on, please let me go. Thank you. Uh, I mean, sure, you go for it, truck. You bloody go for it. Now... This route will only take me so far... Oh, crap, I've seen the helicopter. Well, the helicopter... Hopefully, if we just carry on along here, the helicopter won't notice my car. That's what we're going for. Yes, yeah, it's, it's not It's not seen me. It's just around the area at the moment, so we're okay with that. We can head underneath this bridge. And then got to find a way in. Now, my personal preference for the gates, I think the left-hand side of the airport is going to be the easier option. The reason I say that is if we can get in that side, I think there are more ways to sneak. We will potentially have the issue with the police. I might throw in a cheeky tactic. Because I take out a guard you know, at the airport, there are, there are police officers around that pile, which is difficult for me to deal with, as well as, you know, the players. Now, what I can do... I'm going really slowly, which is not really a clever thing to do. What I can do is take out a guard and... Uh, call Lester, sorry. Give myself a... Uh, whatever the, the time limit is to not be chased by the police. And then sneak in that way. Or shoot people that way without getting a wanted level. Now, that could work. It's still risky, but it could work. Where I would... Okay, here's a thought. Here is a thought. If we can drive ourselves up to... Can we get... Yes, we can get down here. Right. Oh, Regina, where are you going, man? If we drive ourselves to one of the main car parks... That is my plan. Oh, piss. We're not supposed to be down here. We're not, no, no one's looking. No one's looking. No one's looking. No one's looking. No one... Someone might be looking. Someone might be looking. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Oh, I thought I could actually turn down there. I can't. I am on the inner ring road now. Which is... Progress? I think... I don't even know which one of these are. No, this is the road that I want. This is the road that I want down here. God, this is not an easy one to be taking. Right, can we see... I mean, there is the... Uh, NPC guards as well are around the place that I have got to watch out for. There was some shouting. I don't think it was directed at me, though. We're going to... Oh, crap. This isn't the way in. Is anyone going to notice a car parked here? Probably not. Let's be honest. I'm not going to be taking that car up to the gates. Please be over. Oh, piss, 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 piss. Bad things are happening right now. Really bad things are happening. Really bad things are going on. Oh, Christ, the car's a wreck. Uh, bugger, we've got to abandon this. This is just too bleeding obvious. Alright, leaving that. We are on foot by the airport. Which is not where I want to be in any way, shape or form. Where I wanted to be was inside a car park. However... Turns out that that is quite difficult. Just keeping an eye on out for guards, basically. Okay, once we're in here, we can sprint. We can climb to the top. Now, cars will spawn inside these car parks. I made an I, <laughs> I made an absolute mess. In fact, my brain couldn't quite comprehend of a sentence that was worthy of that mess of my approach here. That that was awful. That was absolutely awful. But we are here, and thankfully the place that I messed up, there was just no one looking at. There was no one looking at that area. Now, of course, being on the roof here is a little bit on the exposed side. 
but I don't really see us having much of a choice. What I can do, if we can run along here, we can get a little bit of an idea of the lay of the land. Oh, we're so far away, though. Not that I want to be going that side anyway. We're going to have a look. Oh, crap. I spy a helicopter. I spy a helicopter. We can't even get over that, so we're going to have to dive into the car park here and hope he wasn't looking. <laughs> I can't I can't spin the camera around well enough here to see if I was spotted in that. Uh, I don't think the helicopter is still here. Okay. Kind of got past that little obstacle. No, we haven't, because it's hovering around there. Bugger. Right. A new plan. Fortunately, we are on the right side of the car park here, for that not to be a major issue. We are going to have to find ourselves a car somewhere. If there's a car in this car park, that'd be really nice. And a car in this car park that doesn't have a horrendous alarm. I don't know if that thing there does. This would probably have been safer, actually. Why on earth did I go to the bloody roof? I'm an idiot. <laughs> I went for the roof for maximum visibility. However, this would probably be safer for me as in terms of, you know, watching the area. We are doing an awful job. Dude, crouch. You're a moron. What have we got in the way of guards on these gates? I can't see one visibly over there. But, I mean, there could be. Now, there is a highly explosive way in. It is very risky because of the noise. But you could explode your way in through... Like you could blow the gate, like the fence up and climb in that way. It is dangerous, but it could work. It doesn't, there's no visible guard over there, which makes my life harder, because I would like to have got rid of them and then just driven up to the gate and walked in. Definitely can't see anybody over there. Um, right, what are we going to want? The sea is probably faster. But the AC might have an alarm on it, and I don't know if they do or not. Uh, let's go have a look, actually. Is the helicopter... The helicopter's over there. So the helicopter's gone. I need to get a better look. I need to get on that bottom road and have a look. Find a place to take out the guard. Please don't have an alarm. Oh, thank God for that. Thank God for that. Oh, there's a helicopter up there. Oh, I don't want that on. How are we going to get past that? Right. Okay, let's try the tactic that people told me about. If we do that, does that lower our window? No, it's still still smashed. Bugger. Oh, I heard some odd noises going on. Okay. We've got, I think we've got to circle round. We've got to circle round and I've got to try and get a, a vague idea of where people are in terms of inside, inside that gate. If I can find where the guard is on that gate, I can take him out and I think I can sneak my way... I say sneak my way and I can kind of walk my way in the initial part and then get round the back. Once we're in the area, I'm okay. Once we can get in the area, I think we will be fine. But it's getting into the area that's going to be the tough part. Right, let's use all of the available time that we can to keep an eye on that gate and see what we might be able to see at that part. Didn't look like much from here. Did not look like we could see much. Oh, I haven't got my lights on. Whoops. <laughs> Forgot to turn them back. I was slightly why the helicopter might be looking that way, um, but uh, I don't think he was. What about this gate over here? Can we see a visible guard? I mean, there's the AI guard. But is there a player guard around there? It doesn't look like there is. They've done a very, very good job of uh, sneaking their way around. Let's go and have a look up this part. I mean, the next one is the one where we really want to check. I can vaguely hear a helicopter. Again, I think the problem is I'm going to be going too fast around here in terms of driving just to look like normal traffic. Then I'm not really going to see what I want to see. 
can't. I can't do it and maintain a decent driving angle there. I can't see anyone at any of these gates. That's a problem. Right, we are going to have to try a new strategy, I think. I did a little bit risky, especially with that helicopter hovering around over this part of the map. But we are going to try approaching by foot. Or just maybe find a building over here that we can that we can go to. What about in here? Where does this lead? Okay, we might have to uh, ditch the car. Don't really know where this leads. And there's a helicopter right up there. This is less than ideal, quite frankly. Alright, okay. What can we do? What can we do? I, don't, I might even be able to take out that. That's a very slow flying helicopter. So I wonder if we might possibly... This is a really long shot that probably won't come off. And if I do shoot at them, they're going to know where I am. But is he going to be able to even see me from over here? Got one shot on him. I'm not going to be able to get that helicopter down. All right, we're in trouble, boys. We are in a lot of bother. There are way too many helicopters hovering around here for me to be able to do too much. Now, I'm hoping they're not going to know where that shot came from. Because there is a lot of buildings around here. Uh, there was another helicopter that seems to have just disappeared. They're going to know... They got shot from somewhere, but they don't quite know where, I think. It is getting night time, which plays into my hands. Or maybe they do know where and they're just trying to send people around to get me. It's going to take them a little bit of time. I'm a little bit penned in right now. A little bit penned in. I can't really do very much about these helicopters uh, without some you know, truly miraculous shooting, which I'm sorry, but I'm not good enough for, basically. I could go for some miraculous shooting. However, I can't do anything. I've got to get out of here. This is just too exposed. <sighs> There goes that plan. That plan is not working. That plan is really not working. Uh, let's hope that they can't see this car. I don't. I think that's going to be a very, very unlikely hope that uh, they can't see the car. I'm not going to be able to get in that way at all. Uh, so we've got to go. Now, my advantage in the way that I've come out here is I'm hoping being hidden by the buildings will buy me a little bit of time. How are we going to do this? How on earth are we going to do this? Is there a way in that I can get to from around here? Oh, there might be. There might be a way I can get closer. Potentially try and get in from this side. We're going to have to abandon the car, I think, again. And we're going to have to do this on foot. We can kind of have a look around the back. And then see if we can possibly, you know, possibly find a possibly find a way to take out a guard sneakily. But I don't really know. Okay, so cars are allowed up to this part. That is the fence to the airport. So let's just pull over and park this here. The fact that we've got no helicopters on us suggests to me that in the dead of night, uh, my <clears throat> shoot and run in a dark car has kind of worked. So... We are right next to the airport. I think I can actually... And I can't clear one level of security fence because... I can, I can probably clear one level. However, I can't clear a second. What have we got from over here, though? I'm kind of trying to be a little bit careful in... Uh, not being too close to everything. But still, you know... I mean, that plane would be the perfect getaway vehicle. I've just got two layers of fence to get over. Uh, also, we're really struggling to focus on these gates. I think that is one of the gates, one of the ways in. Can't spy any guards at the moment. Could there be anyone on the roof? I mean, there could be, but I can't. Again, I can't see them. Hmm. Oh crap, I can I can see a helicopter over there though that's just come down. Oh no, that's a plane, that's not a helicopter. Okay. Sure. Um 
Hmm. This is difficult. This is really very, very difficult. Uh, what are we going to do here to try and get in? I don't know how we're going to get in. Because from this end, there's no gates in multiplayer that open. We're going to have to go... If I could get over there, that'd be great. We're going to have to go for that, mm, that entrance, this side, I think. And what I've got to hope for is that my shot will have distracted them. It's probably a bit too much to ask for, really. Oh, I love how my car, and only my car here, has despawned. Don't really want to get the ballista. I know the ballista sets off an alarm as well, so we're not going to go for that. We're going to go for the ingot. Is there anyone around at the moment? No. We are going to do... We're going to have to... Please close the door. We're going to kind of have to hope that distraction is going to be my best friend. That someone is not going to be paying attention to their designated area. Because my plan of sneaking in the side... Unless... Could we potentially get up there? Ooh. Ah, no, you see, because it's only at the level that we were at before. Maybe we can get a better view, though, on this area. If there is a guy hanging around... So that's the gate we're coming in from. As far as I can see, there is nobody about. Yeah, it does look like there is nobody about. Okay. That's where we're going for. That's where we're going to go. We're going to drive the car in. It sounds like a little... <laughs> like I've spent a really long time faffing about trying to... Uh, get an in and we're basically going to drive through the front door simply because I'm hoping and this is a really big hope that I have distracted them enough at the other side at the other gate that they are not going to know where I am coming from and that they might have neglected that gate I could even oh, I think I need a car though right, I had a dumb idea I could even try and walk it on foot but I think I need a car for them to open the gate Otherwise, I don't think they will. Hmm. I'm fully expecting there to be literally somebody kind of in the in the corner. And as I come in, I'm going to get shot to bits. But I don't really have another choice at this moment in time. We're going to go for the same sneaky strategy. I can't see any helicopters up and about for now. So we're just going to make this corner. This is it, folks. This is really the uh, the do or die moment. I'm going to do the same stupid ass turn, but it's really the only way in. Unless I see a better route, unless I spot someone, we're just going to kind of dive in and really hope that there is no one paying attention. Right. Excuse me, first guard. Hello. Don't mind me. I am nobody. Oh, no. Oh, for God's sake. I've also seen where they are. I have seen where they are. The. That gate there does not open from the outside. Bugger. 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 Okay, new plan. New plan is uh, in effect. Kind of hoping, basically, there's not going to be nobody around. Uh, <laughs> which is a little bit too much to hope for. Where does this go? I hope that there's nobody watching where I went. They knew what gate I tried at. But I don't think they saw where I went. So, what we're going to do here, poke our nose out a little bit, scope out the joint, and head up the stairs. If we can head up the stairs and take someone out, I don't know, we may well be able to climb over the fence here. Now, it's a little bit risky, we were over the first layer of defence, really. A little bit risky. However, and also the, the flight school thing is a little bit of an awkward position. We are going to take a slight tumble. Right, go. Oh, don't die. Ow, that hurt my head. <laughs> we are the worst. We are literally the worst break-in artists in the history of GTA V. However, what I'm hoping is my failed attempt with the car has drawn away people's attention. So my failed attempt to get in has hopefully sent perhaps a guard that was around here on a little bit of an exploration 
which has allowed me to get in here un unhindered. Unhindered? Is that a word? I don't know. Okay. Now that we are in here, though, let's have a look at what we have got as far as option goes. Now, getting across to the planes over that side is going to be really bloody difficult. It's going to be really difficult. So... What way? Oh crap. A spider car. Has a car spied me? Yeah, it has. That's not good. That's not good at all. Uh, right, we're just going to wait for him to stick his head out. And we're going to have to. We have to go in all guns blazing. Bugger. That's not worked. Oh, we did so well to get in. Like, we got in here fine. But now we have uh, got bigger problems on our hands. Because he's now going to be telling everyone exactly where I am. Uh, we can probably take him out, which is okay. Ah, oh, missed him. Get, get his hands while he's reloading. Uh, we are getting shot from somewhere. I don't even know where we're getting shot from. Get back down again, moron. Ah. Bugger, 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 bugger. Uh, someone is shooting me from... I don't even see where I'm getting shot from. Right, plan. We're gonna. It's going to hurt, but it was going to be a, quite an important one to try and get me out of trouble. Uh, we are really limited in terms of options here. Uh, we have got superior weaponry. I've got to watch that way as well, so see that they don't head in. I know what we can do. Ah, do we have? Yes, we do. Right, okay. Uh, I can't really see where I'm throwing this. Just go for it. Uh, hope that does the trick and gets the person. No, we got the car. <laughs> Damn it, that was an escape plan. That was literally my escape plan. Uh, for how I was going to get out of this situation, was to kill him, run to the car, and drive my way out. Somebody was shooting us from down here, but I couldn't see where they were. Uh... Oh, bugger. This is really bad, because I'm now at a situation where I'm trapped. I can't go back out that way, because... Ooh, I've just seen what's heading here. Oh, crap, it's going to get stuck out there, isn't it? Oh, damn it, if that opened the gate, we could have got in that, and we could have made it in. How are we going to get through this mess? We're going to have to move up at some point. Uh, we are secure... Oh. He was down there, I just couldn't see him. We got into the airport. We made it into the airport. We were sneaking through the airport. It was going so well. And then I was sort of stood on the stairway at an awkward angle and just got spotted all at the wrong moment. Yeah, we didn't get away. We did not escape the uh, country that time. I made it in, but uh, yeah, that was unfortunate. It was very, very unfortunate. Just completely awkward timing. My uh, my method of distracting was uh, quite helpful. However, the um, method of getting away cleanly just it didn't quite pan out. It was so close. But uh, I think the guards got back into their positions quick enough. However, that is going to be it for this video, guys. We might have to try escaping the country once more at uh, a later date. Thank you very much for watching, and until next time, uh, goodbye. Please land it. Please land it. Oh, just about. I'll take it.